Yo, what's happening, guys? I'm here today. I'm going to talk to you about the bike I just bought. Yeah, bought a really cool bike. Uh, it's a 2007 YZ250F. And I got this bike for a crazy deal. I got this bike for 600 bucks. 600 bucks. The guy couldn't get it running. And, uh, yeah, I brought it home. And uh, I checked it all over. And what happened, his uh, kid uh, filled the exhaust full of water, and the water ran down and sat on top of the piston. They couldn't get it running. And uh, so I thought that's all that was the matter. I would I thought I had to drain the water, clean the oil out, whatever. Uh, so I drained the water out, couldn't get it running. The only way I could get it running was by getting it pulled up and down the road with a four-wheeler, and then it would come running. And I noticed there was it was running a little weird. So anyway, I decided while it was idling to check the the, the press stone inside the rad when it was running, and I actually had fumes coming out of the radiator. So that led me to believe that I needed a head gasket. So here it is. Here's the bike. I got it all tore apart. I should have made a video of it. Sorry about that. I didn't. But what was wrong was the head gasket. Uh, right over here, you can see where it was leaking. There's a little spot right there. But anyway, head gasket's bad. I'm going to change the oil, put a new filter in it. But as you can see, this bike uh, had some money put into it. It's got a brand new tire, uh, fairly new uh, chain and sprocket. I did a little bit of polishing just to see how the frame would come out. Um, This rim here. Uh, this rim, it's, uh, it's pretty shitty. I've been flaking it off right here, um, uh, trying to clean it up, but I'm not really too worried on all the pretty stuff on it. I basically just want to get this head gasket. I ordered the head gasket. They said five to seven days. So I want to get this thing running. I want to see how well it's going to run. And I'm probably just going to run it like this for this year. Uh, I don't really want to spend too much time on it in case I do end up putting it all together and, you know, it blows up, whatever. Anything can happen, I guess. So, if this treats me good and uh, I run this all the rest of the summer and the fall, this winter I'll take the the tires and rims and everything off and get them powder coated, clean up the engine, give it some fresh paint, polish all the frame, get it all looking nice. Because this bike, $600 bike. Can't go wrong. So, that's part one of this video. And, uh, yeah, keep up to date. And uh, we'll see where this goes. I say I'm going to build it this winter. But who knows? Maybe I'll get bored and start cleaning it all up before the winter. Take it easy, guys.